What's up everyone, we have another Prey movie update here for you. So 20th Century Fox have released another couple of TV spots giving us a glimpse of a couple of new weapons we've not seen before. The first is from a short trailer released on YouTube called the Can't Miss trailer. It's pretty much all existing footage we've seen before from the other trailers, but there's actually a couple of seconds of new footage which I'll play for you. I've gone ahead and fast forwarded it to the point with the new footage. So blink and you'll miss it, but now I'll play it again but slow down so we can get a better look. Let's so select 0.25. So this looks to be some kind of a spear gun looking weapon. You can see the projectile kind of hovers there like it's levitating, like it's being controlled by an anti-gravity field. And then here you can see the actual weapon itself. There's the barrel, so to speak, and these bits that come out the sides and then his hand holding onto it and then you can also see here he is actually using the laser sight on his mask you can just make it out there so it looks like this is what he uses the laser sight for in this movie as we've seen that he does have the targeting laser but the director said he doesn't have a plasma caster which is what the sight's normally used for so it looks like the projectile here I think looks like it's it may be guided and works kind of like a heat seeking missile so then he would fire it out and then it would track towards whatever the lasers pointed at. I think this looks like the weapon he has on his back in the other picture we looked at the other day. I thought it looked like a sword inside of a sheath but I actually do remember I read a comment on that other video that said he that said that he thought it looked like a spear gun and it looks like he was right. I really like the look of this weapon because it's advanced looking. The design of the Predator himself looks less advanced but his weapons are still advanced looking because he is still capable of space travel so it makes sense. And then here we have another TV spot that they released on Instagram. It looks like he seems to be holding up some kind of a melee weapon and it has a hook at the end. So I don't know, maybe if this is kind of his version of a tomahawk. And you can also see uh, the metal part under his mask, which I talked about in the other video. So it looks like he does actually have a bio mask underneath the skull. And then finally, we have a few more new images showing some of the human characters. So let me know what you think about this news. The film's not far off now, only another week or two to go. I've been reviewing each Predator film on the lead up to the new movie, and I've done the first two so far, and I'll have Alien vs Predator up tomorrow, so if you don't want to miss that, make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Also, don't forget to give this video a like as well. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.